subscribe to my channel. Come and hop on this pony. Come and hop on this pony. Cannot dive in your ocean. our family so today I'm back with another YouTube video and today I'll be doing a um, makeup tutorial and also a story time and um, I had went on Instagram and I had um, posted something on my story saying did you guys want me to do a story time or a makeup tutorial and you guys kept saying both so <sighs> looks like I'm about to be doing both today but um I'm going to start with my eyebrows first, and eyebrows take a little bit longer, so um, I'm going to just do my eyebrows off camera, and I'll see you guys when I get Alright guys, so I just did my eyebrows, um, so, <laughs> it's so funny to me, but today's story time is supposed to be my first fight, and I have to go into details, um, Hopefully my mom don't see this, but, uh, yeah. So my first fight was in middle school. Um, wait. Oh, yeah, what am I doing? Yeah, yeah, My first fight was in middle school. Um, with a white boy. I was in the eighth. All right, sorry about that, y'all. I'm back. I'm starting to get dark outside, but I'm going to hurry up and try to film this video. So... It was in middle school. We were both in the eighth grade, and um, we keep in mind that we have been beefing for like it had been like for like about two weeks, and this man would always like mess with me and like call me out of my name, call me ugly, and I wasn't even letting letting it get to me at first. But then, like, a couple days went by, and I was just like, you know what? I'm kind of done. I'm kind of getting tired of him calling me names. Like, if somebody don't deal with it, I will. So, you know, I didn't want to get suspended, of course, because, you know, in middle school, you can get suspended. Matter of fact, expelled. And I was not trying to get neither. Because, you know, I was trying to be a good girl at the time. So, this boy. Oh, so I go to the principal's office, right? And I make a witness statement, not a witness statement. I report him to the principal's office. And so they're like, oh, we're going to handle it, you know. Like they always say they're going to handle stuff, but never do. So a day went by after I had went to the office and reported him. This man go walk inside the classroom. Sorry, I'm looking out the window, y'all. Sorry. This man go walk inside the classroom and was like, he gets in my face and starts saying, you B-I-T-C-H, you're ugly, you're this, you're that. I was like, bet, bet. Keep in mind, this was around like, like, third period, because I think during fourth period, it was like third period, lunch, then fourth period. Yeah, that's how it was in middle school. So like, during lunch, no, this was during my third period. I'm like, bet, all right. And so, I guess, when he walked out the classroom, he called me a nigger. I was like, I'm just sitting there cooling, because I didn't hear him say that, until one of the girls was like, oh, everybody was like, oh, and I was like, what? And they was like, you didn't hear what he called you? I was like, no. I was like, what did he call me? They was like, he called you a nigger. I was like, no, he didn't. I was like, no, he didn't. And they was like, oh, my mama, he did. And so, I was like, if he really said that, like, tell him to say it to my face. So, I guess this little white boy was bold. He must have been bold. Like, he must have been extra bold that day. Because um, I was walking around my friends at lunch looking for him. He was nowhere to be found. Until we walked past that bathroom and he came out. Then that's that's when it really happened. That That's when that's when it all went down. So, he comes in my face and he's like, I was like, so what you call me? He's like, I called you a nigger. Then he gonna run in the bathroom. You're not safe. You're not safe. You won't think I won't go in there. 
so y'all walked away. No, I didn't walk away. I went up in that bathroom. I went up in that bathroom, and that's when it went down. That's all I got to say. I went, he know, I'm not going to say his name, but it was a white boy. So it was this racist white boy. And he eventually, after the fight happened, I got a couple hits in. Um, he was bleeding, bleeding from his nose. It was just, I like punched him in his nose like one good time. And then like, he was in there crying like, oh, my nose, da -da -da -da. he was like, stop, I can't breathe, stop, I can't breathe. So I was like, whatever. I'll stop. And so I walk up the bathroom and that's when the proctor was like, oh, sexual harassment, da -da -da -da. you need to go to the right principal office. So they had walked me up to the office, and I'm just like, okay, well. So on the way out to the office, the proctor's asking me, like, what happened? I was like, oh, a fight just happened. And the boy's bathroom? Yeah. And so I was telling her how he had called me out of my names and how the principal didn't deal with it. And, um, you know, how they said they were going to deal with it, and they never did. Like, once you tell me you're going to deal with something and you don't deal with it, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna handle it on my own. Like, I'm gonna just handle it on my own. Okay. So, I'm in the pre vice principal's office sitting down, and he was like, here, fill out a report. Didn't I already fill out a report earlier in the week? And you telling me to fill out another one. So I'm sitting there and I'm filling out a report and I'm writing down every little detail, what happened. And so they had, like usually, I know when like, like my freshman year in high school when I had gotten into a fight, that's for a different time. My freshman year when I had gotten into a fight, they had um, escorted us one at a time to the office or they had put us in separate rooms. Why are they going to put this man right next to me? So I get up. And he's still going and still going. I'm like, do you want it to be a second round? Like, do you do you want some more? Because I wasn't done. I had just got started. You lucky your friends broke it up. And so, then, like, I sat back down because the principal came out. I was like, chill out. Sit down. It's not that serious. Like, you're already getting in trouble. This, that, and the other. So, um, there was a guy, and the guy didn't like me. He was racist, honestly, in my middle school. He was really racist. He didn't like me, and I don't care. And so we had a lady. Now, this lady used to live right next to me, and my mom knows her. My mom and her are, they well, my, they're not friends, but my mom, like, knows of her. And so um, she was like, oh, come inside my office. So I go in my office. I'm sitting there. She's like, so what happened? So... I'm giving her every little detail, telling her what happened. She was like, okay, well, I'm sorry that it didn't, um, it wasn't dealt with. And, um, this dad, now usually they're supposed to let your parents know, but since she knew me, I was just like, you know how my mom is, just don't tell her, you know? And so, like, she was like, if you get good grades in school, I won't tell her, because at the time I had bad grades. So yeah then i i and he didn't then after that he uh he moved away and i never seen him again but if you're watching this video and um just know who you are if you want around to let me know because um i know you're still not about that life i mean you acted like you was about that life in middle school but we bigger now You talked all that crap then. I mean, this is a new year. But, um, yeah. Let me tell you something, little white boys. Um, y'all think y'all bull. Y'all think y'all real bull. Y'all sit there and y'all talk all that crap. Y'all talk all that crap, but never want to run y'all hands. Like, period. So, um, I'm almost done with my makeup. It's getting really dark outside, and, like, I got this light right here so y'all can see, like, my makeup or whatever. But, um, yeah, that's the story time for today. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. 
and make sure you guys go follow my Instagram and my go at me on Snapchat. And I will surely have more videos dropping for you guys. You guys can hit me up in my DMs and let me know what you guys want to see next. I will do anything you guys request. Anything. I'll do a vlog. Anything y'all want to see. I got y'all. Oh, um, tomorrow I will be dropping another video. And, um, the video tomorrow, I don't know. I don't know what it's going to be. Well, I do know what it's going to be, but you're going to have to go and watch it yourself. But, um, yeah. <laughs> Everybody know this is my favorite song. I don't even care. I don't even like NBA Young Boy like that, but this song. Yo, I like this song. I don't care. I like the song, yo. I'm not even. I don't even care. BTW. This is called translucent powder. Or y'all call it bake. Ooh, look at that. I'm looking for something, y'all. So, found it. <laughs> Put a little bit of water on it. Look at too much. Y'all, it's starting to get really dark. I'm so sorry. Like, hold on. Yeah, that just... Guess that made it better. But yeah. I'm just finishing up my makeup. What? Y'all better stop playing with me. Oh my gosh. My highlight is life. Look at that. Look at them edges though. My highlight is life. I look pale right now, you guys. It's because of that light. But when I hit the shade, it's <laughs> an ugly face. I'm sorry. We well, don't need nobody watching this. All right, so you guys, I'm all doing my makeup. So, okay, thank you. You're welcome. 
So I'm all done with my makeup. My hair was already done. I'm just making it bigger. But um, make sure you guys please, please, please comment. Um, follow me on Instagram. Add me on Snapchat. And um, I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, Zazar family. Love you guys. Come and hop on this pony. Come and hop on this pony. Can I dive in your ocean?